Well, if you've ever reached for some ice to cool down a drink and realized it was a bit stinky or maybe it tasted weird, we've got a trick for you. Consumer Reports explains how to guarantee fresh smelling and tasting ice every time you check your freezer. It is a surefire way to ruin your drink. Many of us have dealt with smelly ice. This usually happens when ice has been sitting in your ice maker or ice bin for several weeks or even uh, over a month, and it's had a long time to absorb the smells of the food that's in your fridge. But there may be another culprit, your refrigerator. This is more common in older refrigerators with one cooling system where cold air passes between the freezer and fresh food compartments, making it easier for your ice to get smelly. The first thing you should do is dump out your entire ice bin. If some of it smells, likely all of it smells. Then you should clean it. Check the manufacturer's instructions. You might be able to put it in the top rack of your dishwasher. If you have to hand wash it, usually baking soda and warm water will do the trick. You should put boxes of baking soda near the ice maker to absorb all the odors from your food. If you don't have an ice maker, baking soda can also help keep odors from creeping into your ice cube tray. Speaking of those trays, it might be time to try Try something new, especially if you're using silicone molds which can absorb odors. This plastic tray from Rubbermaid is a good option. The same goes for this tray with a lid from OXO. Once your ice smells nice again, treat yourself to a frosty frozen beverage. These blenders from Oster and Nutribullet ace consumer reports tests. And speaking of cocktails, it is only 6.19 in the morning, but I don't make the rules. Some refrigerators, they now have specialty ice makers that can actually make ice spheres or nugget ice for your favorite beverage. 